am back with uh, one more video we are going to paint uh, orchid today and it has been a tricky uh, flower for me because it has some um, what you call tricky center part which it took some time for me to learn uh, the brush I am using this has no brand on it it's a uh, 3 by 4 Mm, angular brush and you can use flat brush also 3 by 4 and another brush that we need for the center part is uh, size 10 plead or any other brand if you want you can use flat synthetic this is one stroke brush by Donna Dewberry and it's size 10 and we want one brush for detailing you can use size 0 brush and color I am using is yellow and light yellow and purple I have mixed a little bit of purple and blue a little bit of purple and blue if you want you can also do that We, I'm first loading my brush. Okay. So on the outer edge, we are having yellow and inside purple. You have to watch me very carefully. First, I will be making the center one. in the top that can be any way either you can make this way or you can make it straight I will show you that also just I have started it this way so I will finish it we can you can do that without um, wiggling your brush and touching this this way here we have to make one two so we need a gap here to make the uh, center petals I'll make one more time on this so how bright it looks done and now let me dry this for a while now I'll be making here and here and it should be a kind of cupping this way from both the side see this way from both the side so I'll be starting like from here covering this like a little bit of this petal from both the edge overlaying it and make a C same way you'll be covering a little part of the lower petals here so little from starting right from here to here if you want to change uh, the look of your uh, petals like if you want it to be more big or a little bit um, 
more white you can go and do it again on that this way and I finished it so now I'll be starting from the side I see I think someone requested uh, to this do this video orchid finish a little bit more out I think you have to come yes yeah this is fine now again let this dry this center part which we are going to do this it's a bit tricky but I want this to dry and at the same time I want to paint one more here for you without wiggling my brush so I'll paint one more here the same way center part see I have not wiggled my brush much see it's a kind of soft finish it's not kind of shell stroke same way two I want here one two and Three. One, two, and finish. So this is a, this is a bit uh, a slightly different way of doing the same um, flower. And starting from here. Okay, so now this is dry. What we need to do is here the use of your 3 by 4 is done. You have to now load your brush um, size 10 or 12 with uh, the same colors. If you have size 12 that is also fine because the stroke there is going to be small. So it's better to use a small brush. So I have loaded my brush now see carefully this and this are the edges and here and here are the edges of your flower what we are going to do that is um, you're going to like join both the edges like with a C like I want C in between this way this kind of stroke and this side this kind of C in between joining both side of your this petals one more time C this side petal you will be covering this way and this side petal you will be covering this way so you get kind of C in between you, here if you see you will have get a clear idea what I'm what I mean to say a gap should be there now I'll be covering my so here from here I'll start from here. See a C this way, and starting from here, this way, center, same way here, as if you are trying to make a C with your brush see okay. 
just messed it up. We should correct this once it dries. Now we are going to fill up the center so work for this brush is also done now maybe we can draw a stem with this and I will further show you what detailing we need to do. So I will put this brush, I will take this detailing brush and we are going to make some dots with uh, yellow here i'm using a kind of darker yellow and we are making dots this way in the center with the brush this way you can even use golden color I shall use now um, some a bit of orange dots on this this way okay then I use the dotting tool you can even use any uh, detailing brush this dotting tool this tiniest one i'll pick white color and make a few dots here you can either make dots only on both the sides or you can even make dots on all the petals it's up to you because because this is a decorative painting and we just think about more and more creativity and how the final outcome is it's was it it's what matters the most when i was searching for the orchid my goodness so many flowers so many beautiful flowers i like to tr i'll just try to paint all of them I'll, I'll just try to make tutorials with different color combination on orchids so many color combination and so many ways of painting these flowers i have discovered from the images nature is beautiful In this shall we paint here a little bit down this way oh, this way here little very little not much and here I'll pick up a little bit of yellow the lighter yellow which we used here out and um, um, for this flower we will do one thing i will load my brush with the black and maybe we will make some lines with black color this way here also one I hope you like this tutorial and I tried my level best to explain this 
even if you have any doubt you can come again and comment and let me know how did you find this tutorial and try to practice so thank you for watching all the best keep painting